Duckies, Andy here, and you guys have tons of issues with docks inside of OBS. Like when you open OBS, sometimes your docks don't go in the right place, or it might forget that you had a dock open and everything like that. Well, now there is a new plugin that fixes just that and does so much more. So this is the JR Docky um, by DC Mouser which is just here, not much information on it just here, but I'm gonna show you how it works. Just click on the go to download button, it'll take you over to their GitHub page, and you just press the uh, the view raw just here, view raw, and it'll download a zip. As you can see just there, we open it up, and just install it like you do your normal OBS plugin. So copy the OBS plugin folder, and go to where OBS is on your PC, usually in program files, and then inside of OBS-Studio, and just paste it in there, It'll ask probably for your admin privileges and that. Just say, yeah, that's Gucci. Uh, and it'll get it all installed. And then I'll do the old Blue Peter thing because I've already got it installed. And we'll open up my other OBS just here. And here's some, some scenes and stuff that I've got here. I've got some docs. Uh, up the top, you will actually have, let, if I just remove this, a doc sets tab if you have set it up correctly. And this doc sets tab can be added into a different tab if you want it to, it's completely up to you. And you do that via the options. And you just type in docs, for instance, because I like to have it in there, and press apply and close, and it'll hide that little tab and put it inside of docs just here. So what this docs does is if I click this at the bottom, it'll resize my docs to wherever I've got them. So right now, as you can see, all my docs look cool uh, and everything's set up in OBS the way that I like it. So I'll go to, uh, where is it? Docs, and we'll reset all my docs. Just like so, so this is like the standard OBS version now. And now I'll go back up to docs, use doc sets and press one my docs and boom, they've all resized exactly how I like them to be which is awesome. So it means that if I've resized my window like this, as you can see, it started squashing them up because you can see my uh, my live chat. Look, everyone's saying hello, it's great. Uh, come and visit me at twitch.tv forward slash Andy Lippy and just press this button and boom, they've resized to the correct sizes. So now it fits. So even though I resized OBS a little bit, it always attempts to put everything the way that you like it which is awesome. So uh, no more of your docs being in different uh, locations and everything like that. It's obviously just all happening really simply. You can set as many of these doc sets as you like um, by saving a doc set. You can load a doc set and it'll keep your previous ones in there as well. So if I move some stuff around, I'll put uh, scenes all the way over here. Maybe I've added uh, my chat and everything like that. I'll add some more docs in. Uh, we'll add scene notes, so I've got so many docs that are just everywhere at the moment, and I've just got them in weird places, which makes resizing quite strange, but whatever. But as you can see, this this might be some some somebody's idea of a good time. So I want to save this, I'm going to go up to docs, doc sets, and then we'll press save current doc set. It saves it uh, inside of your OBS file as well, so you can do another one. Um, I'll just call this docs1 and save, so you can give it a name. And then now if I go back up to docs, doc sets, you've got my docs, my docs one. There we go. So that resets it to how I had it before. Go to docs again, doc sets, doc sets one, and boom. So you can set a bunch of different presets for all your docs. Such a cool little plugin. Trust me, you need it. Just download it, it's great. Obviously leave a review and everything like that. And if you guys found this useful, make sure you do subscribe and all that jazz. Put your rock with the stone. Much love.